Welcome back my Leos. I'm back again with another video for y'all. So this is going to be for the upcoming week uh, from the 17th through the 24th. Okay, from the 17th through to the 24th is when um, it's going to be the time frame for this message. Okay, we'll say the 25th. So the 17th through the 25th. Okay, and we'll see what messages we got for you. So general read, guys. So whatever pops out, pops out. But we're going to pop it off with Leos. We're going to pop it off with Leos because Leos got the most views, okay? Leos got the most views, so you guys get your readings first, okay? Y'all commented the most. You liked the most. Um, and I got the most views for last week for Leos. So you guys are going to get your readings first, all right? So... I want to let you guys know if you all oh, as well, guys, if you're new, go ahead and click that bell to subscribe. You don't want to miss out on future videos as well. Guys, you can check out the website. I do have the money bag oil, guys, the money bag oil. Yes, yes, yes. She is in stock. OK, she is in stock. <laughs> Y'all sold me out a few weeks ago, so she is back in stock. OK. We got the manifestation candle here as well. All right, so that's going to be on the website, guys. The website is in the drop box below if you would like to purchase um, any item from the Empress Empire store, all right? As well, guys, I am currently doing the $10 for 10-minute readings as well as the $20 read. Guys, with the 10-minute read, you get three cards, okay? With the $20 read, you're going to get um, five cards, okay? So... Um, only thing that I'm going to need from you guys, I do it so PayPal and cash out. Well, if you need an invoice, you can be invoiced as well. Um, all I'm going to need from you is your date of birth and your name. You contact me via email. Okay. And you get to choose from general love or career. Okay. So all of that information is in the drop box below. All right. So let's hop into it guys. What messages are there for Leos for this upcoming week? All right. We got the Ace of Wands. Okay. All right. And the Ten of Wands. <clears throat> Queen of Cups. Three of Swords. Judgment. And the Eight of Swords. Okay. So things are kind of like... <clears throat> there's it's kind of like you guys are waiting here for some someone or something i got the hangman and the strength card the hangman is pisces is energy but this is also talking about when things are just in the air you know you haven't really decided or there really hasn't been a decision that has been made there's this is also talks about delays okay Okay, so it looks like with the Ace of Wands, you guys could be, you know, contemplating on a new beginning, a new start. Yeah, okay, a new beginning, a new start. All right, and you're trying to manifest something real good this time. Like, something that happened in the past, it looks like you um feel burdened by that situation okay you put in too much you put too much into it so now it looks like you're trying to manifest something even bigger even greater okay the magician and the six of wands here yeah you're thinking of something new you're thinking of a new you want something new Okay, you want you looking for that new new. For some of y'all, we got the king of wands. You looking for a little cutie, okay, who you can be with, okay, who you can cuddle with. Y'all know it's getting ready to be cuddle season. <laughs> y'all know it's, it's time, like the time, the cuffing season is here, okay. You might don't even really look, you might not even be looking for, you know, in my mind. For some of you, it's no strings attached, you know. You might just be looking for, for a little boo thing, okay. You're waiting to see. Okay, we got the three of wands and a page of swords. You waiting to see who gonna get mad, okay? <laughs> you waiting to see who gonna be jealous, who gonna get mad, okay? Because I feel like you're you're trying to make a shift. You're shifting things, okay, to work out in your favor. And you're gonna sit back and you're gonna watch, 
Okay, you're gonna sit back and you're gonna watch. I feel like you've been putting in a lot. You put in a lot of effort. You put in a lot. Yeah. Yeah. You go hard. That's the thing about it. You you go real, real hard. And when you do, and when things don't go the way that you expect them to go, it may hit you real hard. Okay. Yeah, you're waiting to see where this is going to go. Okay. <laughs> Queen of Cups. The, I just saw the King of Cups jumped over, but it went back in. We got the Six of Pentacles that, that jumped out. Okay, I'm getting like, you just feel, I feel like some of y'all feel like, you know, oh, well, you missed out. Okay, you missed out on something good. Okay, you missed out on something good. I'm a catch. I'm a whole ass catch out here. All right. <laughs> For some of you, you could be dealing with the King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Um, but I'm just getting like you're tired of you're really to the point where you you're you're burnt out. Okay. So now you're looking for something new. Like I said, you may not be wanting to take this too too serious because you're kind of like still kind of like getting out of something that could have you know weighed you down a little bit. You're getting over a, a breakup, is what I'm seeing here. You may want to know if this person went back to their ex. If is that the reason that it didn't work out? Um. Yeah, see, we got the Six of Pentacles. I'm sorry, the we got the Queen of Pentacles here and the Ace of Pentacles here at the bottom of the deck, okay? So the Ten of Pentacles as well as the Six of Wands, this talks about financial success, financial gain, okay? Um, maybe with the judgment here, I feel like some of y'all may feel, y'all are mad, okay, with the past energy, I'm getting like y'all are extremely pissed off, okay? There is some type of battle or some type of disagreement that went kind of crazy, like went all over the place, okay? You may have found out that you could have been being used or somebody was, you know, you how, how beneficial you were to someone and you found out that this person was just, yeah, see, we got the four of wands. Some of y'all found out that someone was married, and they've been portraying to be single. I'm seeing that as well, too. Yeah, this person walked away. Eight of Cups. This person might have told you. And see, you've been helping. I feel like a lot of y'all been helping this person financially. Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, the Empress. You know, somebody's been telling, like, you've been telling this person that you love them. Like, y'all had got real deep. King of Pentacles. But I'm getting like somebody's hiding. They were hiding something all along. See, you was waiting for this to come out because you didn't know the whole truth about this person. But you found out that this person was a liar. Okay. And that was just past energy. So now it looks like y'all are on to something new. Okay. You're, you're ready to put that situation to rest. And you're ready for something new. All right. So future energy. Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords. Okay. Eight of Swords and a Five of Swords. Are you afraid that things are going to get too out of hand if you say something? Who is this Queen of Pentacles? Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Yeah, you may be a, kind of afraid um, to speak your how you really feel. Um, Because you, I, I feel like you, you feel like... You may feel like you're going to be judged and people are going to try to make you out to be a liar. Okay. And, and that's no fun. Okay. So, so now you, you feel as if you have to protect your 
reputation, your emotions. Now you have to feel like you kind of got to guard yourself, okay? And some of you are, um, we're holding on to this. It's time to close this chapter, okay? It's time to close this chapter, okay? This chapter is over and done with. Y'all y'all solely need to focus on something new, bringing new energy in because this situation here, it's a wrap. It's over with. You need to let it go. You need to let it go and and push forward, okay? Because the person that you're dealing with, they they weren't for you, okay? You could have been dealing with a karmic situation, but this situation wasn't it, okay? This situation was not it. Let's see what they want to say. Why won't you give me space? I can't grow. You're too good for me. I don't deserve you. So this person already knows that they don't deserve you. Like, you're too good. You're too good. I'm ignoring other people. Leave me alone, please. They could be ignoring you, okay? And it's because somebody here can't let go of the past. Somebody's dealing with ego issues as well. And they may be putting you on hold because they're going to try to come back to you later. So do you want to be somebody's like, I don't, I don't, I don't approve of that at all. <laughs> we ain't nobody rebounds around here. We don't do that. We don't, I don't, I don't preach that. I don't, I don't entertain that. Like they are literally trying to put you on hold so they can like possibly like come back to you later. If something else that they have going on does not work. Nah. Mm -mm. Show me what does this other person have going on. Yeah, they're 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 with someone else. We got courtship. Yeah. They're with someone else. It could be someone who's older or they feel like this person is more mature. Gosh, it's like um, they're flying out so many. They got a lot they want to say. Okay, for some of you, there's children involved. They're focused on their children. Yeah, their finances as well. They feel like you are expecting them to they feel like you're expecting for them to be like your your main person like they're they're they feel like you're expecting is it too much to say that you expect for them to be like your lover their main person whatever whatever um they feel like they have to work on themselves to be the person that you want them to be they i don't feel like they're there yet their focus they're, they're, they're messing around, okay? We got courtship. For them, this could have been something sexual, okay? Um, I do want to see. Why is family room here? High honor. Okay, so maybe there is, uh, someone in the family wants... They, they may be having something going on in the family, okay? That, that is where their focus is as well. They're trying to hold a certain um, expectation for someone in their family. Could be like their mother. Okay. Some of them live with their mother. I'm going to put that out there too because we got mature woman and house. Thoughts, official person. Yeah, they're concerned about how this mature woman thinks of them. They also, with children, 
they also I saw okay we got change and child um I'm not sure if the, there's children involved or this is a baby mother baby father thing or they have children or you have children there's something about like a change a shift privileged lady okay it's like the child is seeing them with different people okay because i got main female and privileged lady so there's two people here a privileged lady someone who you know may be very well off but then they have a main female they have somebody at at home that they that they really deal with or have been with for a long time this is kind of like the it seems like they're in the thinking process as well but I, I do see them, yeah, they have, they're courting with someone possibly at a distance that they're stuck on, okay? Yeah, it's like they feel like you expect for them to... Because uh, we got lovers, main female. They love whoever this main female is, whoever their main person is. They they actually, you know, have feelings there. It's not like this is just someone that they, you know, have on the side. This is someone that they could care for. And they feel like you expect for them to be so mature and be their main male. When I feel like they they already had something going on. I'm not sure if you knew about it. I'm not sure if you're just finding out. But they have a lot going on as well. And they're in their head about it as well. All right. So y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. Okay. Um, I'm going to chat with y'all on a later date for next week. Okay. Ciao for now.